History of the birth of Kosovo. Do you know who created the state of Kosovo? The Americans? Or the Europeans? This is like you're asking, did the chicken or the egg come first? In fact, the state of Kosovo was not created by either the Americans or Europeans. The state of Kosovo created itself. Just like the birth of Jesus Christ. Everything happened in one evening like this one tonight. It was winter or summer. That's not important. A night with no moon or a half moon. Outside could be heard the singing of birds, the barking of dogs, and cows, and then Kosovo was born. Beautiful, healthy, four kilograms. <laughs> <laughs> a good joke, eh? Or not. In fact, it's more complicated than that. Much more complicated than that. In the beginning, rivers of blood were spilled. Then, at the end, again rivers of blood were spilled. And when the, everything was over, once again, some more rivers of blood were spilled. Then, not to intervene, to stop the bloodshed, the murders of innocent civilians. They, I mean, the West, including the Germans, dropped some small bombs on Belgrade, and few more bombs. And then, Milosevic raised his hands up, he cried like a child, he tore out his care in grief, and then, he capitulated. And talking of Germans, they really did drop some bombs in this war. But they very, very, very anxious about it. Like some women who hate undressing at the gynecologist. They felt bad. Because actually they hadn't touched the weapons themselves. Since Second World War. But they did it. And it was good that they did it. But thank God. They were not encouraged to carry on further. Because Germans in general are enthusiastic people. And when they get enthusiastic, then there is no limit. They just march on. But let's just leave Germans aside. We were explaining how the state of Kosovo was born. Such a lovely creation. So innocent. A lovely baby that grows up with much love. Sucking the east. And sometimes more the west.